All right, so NBA Youngboy's out of jail, but let me tell you something. That boy ain't free. Oh, no, he ain't free. NBA Youngboy stipulations include a 24-hour house arrest in Utah, electronic location monitoring at all times, travel restrictions to Baton Rouge and parts of Utah and California. No more than three visitors can be in the home at a time. All visitors must be approved by a judge. No visitors between 9 p.m. and 7 a.m. He cannot break any laws, of course. He cannot possess a firearm and he cannot use any narcotics that's not prescribed by a doctor. Now, let me tell you why this is fucked up and a blessing at the same time. NBA Youngboy was never going to sit in jail. Let's be real about this. He's the king of YouTube. He's the top earner for these guys. They know what it is. We know what it is. He know what it is. It was just a matter of time before they greased enough palms for them to let my mans out. But the problem with this is in order for them to let him out, the label had to do a $2 million pledge to build a studio inside of his home. Now, let me tell you something. If the label announces they're putting $2 million behind you, they're really putting $10 million behind you. And what they're trying to do is they're trying to keep Youngboy in his deal because, let's be real, he was trying to get out of it. He was trying to go independent with a distribution deal, and they didn't want that. They didn't want that being solved. So Youngboy got caught up, and they said, yes, we got this nigga. So they put him back under the thumb, and Youngboy's going right back to where he belongs on a label. It's fucked up at all times. But the blessing is, the last dash, he cannot use any narcotics that's not prescribed by a doctor. Now, I know NBA Youngboy fans is going to kill me. I'm an NBA Youngboy fan as well. But let's be real. Ever since AI Youngboy 2 dropped, he's been on a steady decline. He's been high off on drugs. His music sounds jumbled. And he has no material. Now, with Youngboy being in jail, Youngboy probably feeling like everybody wasn't loyal and fucking him over. And the fact that he's sober, I think we're going to get the best music out of Youngboy that we had since AI Youngboy 2. I'm looking forward to this new music because we know we're going to get it. ASAP, and I'm looking forward to young boy being home, free, safe, and with his kids, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Like, subscribe, comment, and get at me.